Well, this is the kind of match every football fan looks forward to. A lot on the line and the likelihood of a tension-packed occasion. We'll have every kick of the ball for you live on EA TV. Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. I'm Derek Ray, joined in the commentary position by Lee Dixon. We've got action from the round of 16 in the Champions League to bring you. It is Bayern Munich up against Arsenal. Yeah, thanks Derek, my favourite part of the competition. Only 16 teams left, group stages out of the way. The big teams come alive. It's the pointed end of the tournament. Gets everybody's attention, it's certainly got mine. I'm very excited. Rashford starts with Leon Bailey in the wide areas, and the role of lone striker in this setup goes to Maximiliano Gomez. Well, the round of 16, a very different feel, almost like a different tournament in some respects, Lee. Well, it is. We're into knockout football, and the pressures that comes with is completely different than when you play in the group stages, Derek. It really is. Players have to switch on. No mistakes. You're not allowed mistakes at this level. Here are the starters for Arsenal. The tactical battle is going to be highly instructive. 4-3-3 on one side and 4-3-3 on the other lead. Well, when you match systems up, it's all about individuals. Who can get the better of the player you're playing against? And in this formation, certainly the wingers are going to be key on either side. And the long striker, when the ball's come in the box, he needs some support from one of those three midfield players making runs into the penalty area. And that was a very fine read. It looks promising. Keeper had his work cut out for him, but delivered. Yeah, that's what they do. Look at that save, a brilliant effort. And firing it into the area. Well, thumped clear. Arangis. Now Ricardo Pereira has it. Space and time for the cross. Read it magnificently and intercepted. Requilon. Well, you never quite know who's going to emerge from the shadows and become a match winner, but this man might be a decent shout. Lee, what are you expecting from him? Well, every defender goes into the game not wanting three goals in three games to be the player you're playing against, and that's the case today. Here's Milinkovic Savic. Well, quite the pre match talk surrounding Tony Kroos. And the reports have been confirmed. He's decided to end what has been a brilliant career at the end of this season. A huge loss for the club, you've got to say, Lee. Well, how do you fill that gap, Derek? Such a great player, senior pro. Pros like him with his CV are worth a waiting goal, a manager's dream. He'll be sadly missed. It did look as though it was rather a fruitful avenue, but nothing doing. Pereira and Vlasic. It's with Oyal Sabal. And he takes it on. It goes straight at the keeper, but technically good goalkeeping. Very attractive looking move. Easy on the eye, but nothing there. Pereira. Arsenal finding avenues to attack from. Now, what can they do from here? 
And it will be an Arsenal free kick. Oh, my goodness! What an outrageous hit! I can't believe he took it on from there, and neither can the goalkeeper. Let's have a look at this replay. Caught the keeper on his heels, and this is why. Short back lift, great strike, takes everybody by surprise. Well, the goal again, albeit from a different angle. Well, all the hard work has paid off, but the manager knows a lot more has to be done to secure this game. Back underway, Arsenal with the lead. Well, you've got to keep the ball a bit better than that. Getting forward, Bustos, Bergen. And the cross is very much on, cross blocked. Arsenal have given it away. Bailey! The goalkeeper relatively untroubled. Yeah, he's, he's not going to let that one in, Derek. Speculative effort here. And good work to deny the chance. Corner kick given to Arsenal. Over it comes. It was well stopped. Well, the positioning is everything for a goalkeeper, and he was in a good position then. Now the delivery. And space for the cross. It might be on for them. A very good tackle. And, that, and he takes on the shot. The keeper making sure that there were no scraps to feed on for the attackers. Nico Elvedi. Pereira given away Marcus Rashford and Bayern the recipients of the free kick here Milinkovic Savic and a goal it is for Bayern well the defence just couldn't cope with this wave after wave of pressure Well, here we see a better angle on it. There's nothing the keeper can do. A significant deflection, and he's beaten. Let's have another view of that goal. Even Steven won a piece on this match. Vrasic, Arangis, as clean as a whistle that challenge. Marcus Rashford, given away. And the referee is going to add on three minutes. Arsenal's free kick here. short pass this could be interesting and very deftly cut out and the managers will now deliver their half time and they begin the second half in the first leg of this Champions League round of 16 tie Pablo Arangis Pereira. Nico Elvedi. Really fine initial touch. Advantage. Arsenal. And scope for the cross. And it's come off the keeper. And Arsenal apply that finishing touch. What a goal that is. It was just a matter of time before it happened.
let's see that again. It's a decent save from the keeper, but it bounces back into play. Where were his defenders? The strikers there pushes it into the net. Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we? After falling behind, the onus is on Bayern to come up with a response. Bustos. Now, well, just a quick reminder that we'll have all the live action for you from Wembley. The Carabao Cup final right here on EA TV. It's Arsenal facing Manchester City. Well, any cup final is a good cup final to be in. I'm really looking forward to watching that one, Derek. The Carabao Cup is waiting. Should be an absolute... Firing it towards goal. And he's fired it against the post. A possession lost, intercepted. Well, very close to the game being over and done there, but not to be. There's still something in this game. Good use of advantage by the referee in Bayern's favour. Teammates could potentially join in. It's with Oyar Saba. Well, just couldn't keep the ball. Hermoso, an important interception. And showing fine vision. He's managed to get in behind. He had just the goalkeeper to beat. He's got it completely wrongly. Well, he won't be watching that when he gets home tonight on a replay. It's a substitution for Bayer. Fabricio Bustos. Luis Alberto. Bailey. Well, a sloppy clearance. What can the opposition do with this? Easy meet for the goalkeeper. And here's Miranchuk. And fed forwards. Absolutely magnificent goalkeeping. Oh, he's almost turning away. He thinks he's scored. The goalkeeper doesn't. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. And over comes the corner. Well, he was being pursued furiously. The effort, though, nothing to write home about, really. No, I think you give the credit to the defender there. Just put him off balance. Inside the last quarter of an hour. Milinkovic Savage. Rashford. And the cross comes to nothing in the end. Can they square the game? The goal seemed to be at his mercy, but defenders don't always have to touch the ball to have an influence. No, it's that pressure that comes from the defender that makes him hurry his shot. Close. Here's Miranchuk. Has a go. A very high degree of difficulty for any goalkeeper. Sheer quality. Quality of the shot and certainly quality of the save. And now the delivery and heading it just over the bar. Yeah, he thinks he's in, he thinks he's scored, and it's just over the bar. Fire 
good throw in coming up well there's a saying in football Derek that you always get one more chance they need that chance right now the fans feel it might be coming too and here's Miranchuk Oyar Sabal Arsenal's free kick here And the free kick caught cleanly by the keeper. It's with Oyar Zabal. Pablo Arangis. Space and time for the cross. Surely! And a goal! Well, as we see, it's a great cross, but what a finish. So hard to wait and be patient when the ball's dropping. He does everything right and finishes it off. A brilliant goal. A chance to revisit the goal. Well, it's a tale of four goals in this match now. Three, one it is. And the referee has deemed that an additional four minutes are in order. One minute remaining. Not what he was intending. Bad pass. There's the final whistle. And Arsenal with the advantage going into the second leg of this tie. Yes, Derek, we're expecting a tight, tight game. That's what we got. But can they keep that advantage going?